one of the reasons I enjoy crushing it at the gym is because I believe that the gym is probably one of the best developers of willpower. It's a really good vehicle for you to develop your willpower. Think of willpower as like a muscle, the same as you would think of your bicep in the gym. If you are doing bicep curls with 10 kilos to begin with, and you're able to do that for 10 reps, maybe next time you would increase the weight to 12 kilos and do it for 10 reps. This incrementation, this it forces the muscle to adapt, right? It forces the muscle to um, be stressed or to have to work under a load that it's not used to and it's going to have to grow bigger and stronger for next time. It's the same thing with willpower. You need to exert yourself over time and increase the amount of exertion so that you have a great capacity of willpower. And a good way to do this is actually through training at the gym. One of the things I like to do to my friends that I train is we'll do a, I'll ask them, yo, how many sets do you do on this exercise, particular exercise? They'll give me the generic answer of maybe I'll do three sets for 10 reps. And I'll say, okay, today we're doing, we're doing three sets for 30 reps. And generally they're able to do it, right? They're able to exert themselves three times more than what they previously thought they could. And they're all surprised. Nine times out of ten, they always do it and they're always shocked. Now ask them a question. If you've been limiting yourself to one third of your capacity, imagine what type of results you can get if you're working at your full capacity. And it's always an eye opener, right? So the gym kind of shows you that you can push through what you previously thought was standard, what you previously thought was normal. Because the body likes to stay in a state of homeostasis. It likes being in equilibrium, right? It doesn't want to exert more energy than what's needed. So once you gain your comfort zone in the gym, it's the same thing as your willpower. You gain your comfort zone, your willpower. So if you want to increase your willpower using the gym, I suggest or I invite you guys to, when you get to the point of, you know, where you usually would stop or where it starts burning and you think, okay, that's enough, add an extra five more reps. At six more reps, at seven more reps, see if you can do it. Try push through it because nine times out of ten, you've been limiting yourself. Your body can definitely take a lot more than what you think it can. Your body is a machine, a evolution machine, right? So I'm not suggesting you do anything stupid. I'm not suggesting you injure yourself. But what I am suggesting is you try see where your limits are. You try push it a little bit every single time. Build that willpower. Build that discipline. Because if you do this, you will notice that you've been bullshitting yourself for a very long time now in the gym and they will make you think about how you've been bullshitting yourself in real life. How you've been limiting the amount of work you can do and the results you've been getting in real life out there in the field because you thought you were working at full capacity when you've been working at 30%. So I hope you guys try this out each time you go to the gym. Try exert yourself a little bit more and it'll build that willpower. It'll make you understand what I'm talking about. Anyway, peace.